percent quotient rule. For the product rule, the formula is F equals U times B, or M prime equals U prime times B plus U times B prime. Um, this is my example, Fx equals 6x squared plus 3 times 12x minus 4. So the first thing you do is you have to know which one's U. So in this case, this one would be U and this one would be B. So then you take the derivatives, as Jackie said, you use your basic derivatives. And the derivative of 6x squared plus 3 would be 12x. And the derivative of 12x minus 4 would be 12. Next, you have to plug in your numbers into the formula. And it's, um, so it would be 12x times 12x minus 4 plus 6x squared plus 3 times 12. And after that, you just solve. So you have to distribute the 12 to this and then. 12 to, and then you get 144x squared minus 48x plus 72x squared plus 36, and that would be your final answer when you multiply everything out. For the quotient rule, your formula would be f equals u over v, or u divided by v, and your final derivative, or your final answer would be f prime equals u prime v minus u v prime, all over v squared. So you do the same thing, you take your derivatives of sine, in the example sine x, you take your derivative would be cosine x, and secant x would be secant x times tangent x. And as in the product formula, you have to um, plug in the numbers. So all you do is, right here, you put cosine x times secant x minus sine x times secant x tangent x, all over secant squared x, and then you just, um, Solve. And your final answer would be f prime x equals secant x times cosine x plus tangent x times sine x all over secant squared x. Um, our common errors, or like a lot of people make these errors, that right here, for example, they bring out the two, and then they bring it to the front, and you get a completely different answer. And for the quotient rule, like in a test, this happened to me one time. I mixed up the formula and like the numbers were all off, so I put like the V somewhere else and then, so you have to make sure you have the formula in the correct order. Yeah. The common error for the product formula would be that somebody, can you just use your primes? So in this case it would be 12x times 12. And you totally forget about your U and your V and you don't use the formula correctly. So that would be wrong. And the same thing for your quotient formula. Somebody would use um, F equals just U prime over B prime, knowing that you would have to use V, B prime, U, and V squared. And that would be wrong too. Because in this case, it would be just cosine Because you need to use these, you, and plug it into the whole formula.